This project is making a friendship bracelet and you'll need some embroidery thread or really you could use yarn or any kind of string or even fishing twine. I have six pieces here and you'll want scissors so you can cut them and tape. Now you could make it out of any colors but I've chosen two blue and two yellow and two red and I'm going to put them together each one should be about as long as your arm, so from your shoulder to your fingers. And you're going to want to match up the ends so that you can tie them together in a knot to start. And you can do this with a grown-up's help if knot tying is hard. It does go a lot faster if you have somebody working with you. And when I learned to do this, I was in middle school. so. My cousins and I would just make these by the hours, but this week I made one with Meg, who's eight right now, and when we were working together, it took us about one hour, and we were able to finish one that is just the right size to fit her small wrist. So that gives you an idea about how long it takes. There's the knot up at the top. It's just a simple knot. And I'm gonna tape this down now so that it's easy to keep it in the place where you want it to be. Now when you start out, it really helps if you separate it out as if it's an old-fashioned broom. If two can come out in one direction on the left, that's what my two red ones are doing. And if two can be in the middle, there are the two yellow that we're gonna put right in the middle. And then let's put these two blue way over on the far right. And we're going to be tying two knots on each ribbon or piece of embroidery thread. So here you have the beginning one is over here on the far left and I call it making a four. I have that one underneath and here's the one on top. That makes kind of a four if you use your imagination. And then I say the rabbit goes under the log and you pull him up to the sky. Yep. And I'm holding that long straight one so he doesn't get away. Make another four. The rabbit goes under the log and up to the sky, holding it down. And now the first one's done. Okay, let's go on to the first yellow. Under the log and up to the sky. That's right, and making that number four, you go under the log and holding it still up to the sky. Now the first two are done. Well, come back here, tape. That happens sometimes. All right, here comes Mr. Yellow, second one. We're gonna make a four, go under the log and up to the sky, that's the first knot. And make another four, under the log, up, 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 up. And there we go. All right, here comes the first blue. We go under the log, up to the sky, and make a second knot. And I'm trying to make the knots about the same amount of tension so they come out looking about the same. There's the second knot and the last one over here to finish out this first row. Up to the sky. Yep, a four under the log and up to the sky. And that is the first row. If you keep going like that, you're going to end up with a beautiful friendship bracelet. And I hope that works for you. I know sometimes doing these things at home, it's different, but I'll show you what ours looked like when we got done. It looked like this. Good luck, friends. We'll talk more soon. Bye-bye.